Okay, we're reviewing the rebar tying machine made in China. Uh, about 225 bucks compared to the Max brand rebar tire that runs about 23 to 2600 dollars. Bought it for this little job. Thought I'd give it a try. Um, so far, I'm impressed with the flat work. Obviously, it doesn't work for structural trying to build cages and stuff, but it works great for the flat. Um, really easy to change out the wire. Uh, not much for instructions, so you kind of had to figure it out. But I was used to that, so not a big deal. Just coil comes out, stick the end of the wire in, and uh, it automatically catches the wire and feeds. Simple on and off switch. Um, yeah, there's really not much to it. I'll demonstrate it here. So that was a misfeed because it didn't have it wrapped around the, the bar correctly. Put my Adobe brick here. Pretty lightweight. Sure saves tie-in. Now this one did not come with any rolls of wire, so you had to buy the wire. I bought a couple packs of it. Um, Wait to see how it worked before I bought too much. But yeah, I uh, for 200 and some bucks, I'm kind of impressed with it. Manufacturer? There's no manufacturer's name. It's just called the Rebar Tie-In Machine Model 880. Battery life? Um, uh, I'd say about three hours I can go with the battery. All right. Uh, it comes with two batteries and a charger. A nice little case. Um, I don't know what else to say about it. Cost? A little over 200 bucks. That's right. Okay. All right. Thanks.